So I'm Matt from Ray Allen, and today we're gonna to take a look at two layer leather collars. So sort of our heavy agitation collars and our mil spec collar, these are the two, the two pieces we want to kind of take a look at right now. So what you've got is you've got two layers of leather, and one of the neat things is we actually buy northern hides so we buy, the leather actually comes from cows in the north. The reason that is, is because the grain in the hide is actually tighter and it's thicker, right? So it's actually heavier leather. So we specifically buy northern hides from a US tanner. What you've got is you've got two layers in here, double stitched together. And when you take this wonderful thing apart, one of the fun things about the mill spec collars is the D-rings at the end of this, right? So as you put it together and you run it through here, the D-ring actually becomes part of the collar. It's not just held in or stitched down. It's actually part of the collar itself. So if for some reason, this piece of leather were to wear, break, or cause you any problems, this ring is still trapped into the collar, which kind of gives you a little bit of redundancy, a little added, a little added benefit. Um, being a two-layer leather collar, the likelihood of that happening is pretty low. It's a pretty heavy-duty piece of equipment. But this is an agitation collar that we've been making basically since the beginning, so almost 70 years. And from there, there's actually been one guy making them for 32 years. Um, so for a long time, we've been making this collar, same guy. So you get consistency, you get quality. Leather comes from the same place, same tanneries. It actually comes from most of the same ranches that have been around for a very, very long time. So that's one of the slick things when you're talking about leather and Ray Allen is you get quality, you get consistency, and you get something that has stood the test of time. I mean, the two the two layer leather collar has been around forever. It is a staple in almost everybody's training gear. It's one of those pieces of equipment that if you don't have it, you should, and everybody ha and everybody pretty much has one, right? Really slick piece of equipment. So when you're sizing a leather collar, basically the measurement goes to the second hole. So if you buy a 24 inch collar, you're, it basically measures to here, and you can go one inch longer to 25, or you can go six inches smaller, right? So a 24 inch collar will go almost down to 20 inches pretty much, or technically up to 25. So when you're looking at sizing, that's one of the things to keep in mind. So we make this collar in a two inch and an inch and a quarter mil spec collar. We make it in black, we make it in burgundy, and we make it in gray. We make it with and without a handle. So we've got a leather handle on some of them that you can grab onto. But these two collars are just, it's a training staple. This inch and a quarter leather collar is on almost every military working dog that has been, uh, you know, in service for the last 50, 60, 70 years. This is a time-tested piece of equipment. You can find all the options on these collars at rayon.com. Thanks for taking the time to stop by and check it out.